I'm Patrick Herbert, Cam Reynolds, sitting for UWBadgers.com, where for the ninth straight year, Paul Bunyan's axe is doing a victory lap in the Badgers' hands after a 38-13 win over the Minnesota Gophers Saturday at Camp Randall Stadium. In the most played rivalry in the FBS, running back James White was the story early for Wisconsin, ripping off three touchdown runs and over 150 yards in the first three quarters. White's third touchdown, a 48-yard scamper, gave Wisconsin a 24-6 lead. Minnesota would close within 24-13 on a 12-yard touchdown pass to A.J. Barker late in the third quarter. From then on, it was all Wisconsin and all Monte Ball. The All-American running back showed the combination of power and speed, rumbling to a 14-yard score, then sprinting away from the Minnesota defense with a 44-yard touchdown run to grab a 38-13 lead. We caught up with the Badgers and the Axe outside the Wisconsin locker room. Monte, you guys exploded last week against Purdue. This week, another over 300 yards rushing between you and James. What's going right? Um, focus. And I believe that we're focusing on things that we weren't doing in those two losses that we had, which was energy and executing the plays. And, and I believe going into practice, that, that's, what, that's what our focus is, and, and we execute on game day. For you personally, was it a matter of the offensive line wearing them down? Because the second half seemed like holes were everywhere. Right, the, the holes were there at the beginning of the game. I just, once again, I need to get back to starting fast, you know, like I did against Purdue. Uh, I feel like I didn't today, but not a problem at all. I'll make sure to correct that and do it against Michigan State. You take pride in watching James run just like that, too? You, it seems like you enjoy it when he has success. Oh, of course, of course. I, you know, the man deserves it. He works just as hard as I do. And the same for Melvin, and uh, that's kind of a good thing when he does that because it puts a little fire under me and uh, to get me going, and vice versa. Never gets old, does it? No, not at all. I imagine you were a central figure in grabbing the axe post game. Yeah, definitely. You know, as soon as it ended, I was running over there trying to grab it, be the first one to touch it. But uh, some other guys got to it first. Did you get your turn to chopping down the goalpost? Yeah, I did. I did definitely. Bo Allen and I both uh, grabbed it. The two, two big Minnesota D linemen, so we got it. As a Minnesota native. What does this mean to you? You probably don't know anything other than Wisconsin beating Minnesota. Exactly. You know, the, the past five years I've been here, we, we've had the axe every single time, and it's just a, it's a blessing. Speaking from today's game specifically and statistically, aside from a, a drive or two here, you guys really seem to bottle up the freshman quarterback, Nelson, for them and kind of have your way a little bit. Yeah, I think overall our defense played a really good game. You know, we had some key three and outs. Uh, obviously, Army had a big pick there on first down at the second half. But, you know, we really just imposed our will in the second half. And, uh, you know, credit to them. They, they fought back. But uh, I think we, we pulled out the W today and we did a great job. This team moves to 6-2 and two on the season now. Yep. What's the mindset right now, long term, for how this team can play out? Definitely, you know, we're definitely a lot of motivation going into Michigan State next week. You know, got to prepare every week like it's a big week, but uh, I definitely think this is going to give us some uh, some fuel to the fire and get after it. The duo of White and Ball combined for over 300 yards rushing and five touchdowns as Wisconsin wins its ninth straight game over the rival Minnesota Gophers. The border battle is over, and Wisconsin has the axe in their locker room as another Badger senior class goes undefeated against the Gophers. I'm Patrick Hurd from Camp Randall Stadium, where Wisconsin wins 38-13.